Hello everyone and welcome to the Happy Hump Day. It is Wednesday again and here's the next episode of Franchise Mode. This is our new Port Bay series in which we're going to build a little franchise zoo right across here uh, next to the side of our lake, which is the new Port Bay Lake, if you will. Um, and I've, I've got a few messages from you guys that you were thinking about uh, New Port Bay kind of in uh, a new port as a city or town in the US. And just to make it very obvious, this is inspired by the New Port Bay Club from this kind of the the hotel style they went for and this is what we're going to do oh my god oh my god Audrey is still dead okay we still don't have a vet right is that the I think we don't have a vet yet and this is the reason why they couldn't be taken yes that is correct we don't have a vet I think we have to employ a vet at this point in time um, and before we actually start doing some stuff today let me just quickly get something uh, out there just because I think it was a little bit of a I don't even know how to call it. It's not even it's it's not even like a um, problem or whatnot. But like a lot of people were actually commenting and reacting to one comment that said um, the last episode felt like I don't enjoy it. And to be honest, I was a bit shocked because I enjoy is the wrong the wrong term. I loved I loved it, and I play franchise actually. Um, for, for those of you who know me and who know the channel, they know that I'm more likely a builder type of player. I'm not really the player of the game itself, like I'm not playing the management side of things that often. I want to do more often in the future because I used to do it in the past for myself, um, but in terms of YouTube, I'm more like the builder type of uh, person. The problem is, and that's, that's also maybe part of the reason why you felt this way, um, Mainly I do this because I can relax while doing this, you know, I can relax sitting down and just building I can do some, you know, if I play in sandbox, I can explain everything to you I don't even need to rush or whatever Over here. It's a little bit of a different story. Okay, so Especially at the beginning you need to make sure that a lot of things are in place to make sure that the money comes in Just as it is doing right now And I just want to make sure that stuff is happening, you know, and this is the main reason why I'm I'm really not paying too much attention to various things at the very beginning. I'm just like, you know, let, let's just do this so we can move forward and set the foundation. And this is exactly what I did. I set the foundation for what we are doing. And today we are actually not doing like a huge new habitat. I mean, you've already seen that from the thumbnail. My plan is to go to our friend, the Terrapin, and uh, do a little bit of a Terrapin habitat over here. Um, I can also plainly, honestly say why. The main reason why I would love to do this is just simply because you guys have seen so many different habitats in the last couple of days, especially, what is that even? Oh my God, that looks so weird over here. Um, especially you've seen me doing seals and otters and stuff like that. And there is so much more coming because of my dome and so on. I didn't want to bore you again with like yet another seal habitat or yet another penguin habitat or yet another, you know what I mean? Um, and I also don't want to go too much into other animals. So I need your help to tell me in the comments down below today what animal you want to see next, okay? It's very important that you guys tell me which animal you want to see in the franchise next. And please make sure to look at more efficient animals rather than going for the predators and stuff because you all know that they, you know, take a lot of money. And before we do so, we really need to have like a work in zoo. So please let me know which animal you would love to see next episode. Um, we will do a seal habitat right over here, but I would love to, you know, wait for a couple of days before we do this. This will go um, over here where you can see money is coming in easily. And we can actually also now uh, deal with these things. High amounts of litter, you're saying, where? Oh, whoa, 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 we are. This is where. Okay, well, first of all, we're going to take it very easy today, okay? You guys, you guys said so, and I'm going to put that into play now. We are going to take it easy today. We are going to solve all the issues, making sure that the groundwork is really nice and tidy and so on, you know, uh, this is really the important stuff. Um, and one thing I learned as well um, during the last couple of things, um, we want to make sure that this is all going up, you know, education at this point is very poor. So what we are going to do right now, we are going to put some education boards right here in the beginning um, because this mainly helps with a lot of things um, and then we also have to employ a mechanic to do some mechanic research um, but just for the beginning we're going to put a few things in here so the people see this and we also put a bit more oh, well this doesn't matter it's already at the at the exit but we can also make sure that they have a little bit of an education already hitting the zoo you know uh, that there's already a little bit going on here uh, just to make sure that they do have already a tiny tiny bit of education um, and what we can also do do we actually have already a caretaker um no well wait hey, we have we've got one okay so what we can do already 
we're just going to upgrade all of them very important you can see the vendors have a very high workload i'm going to put one more vendor down over here and going to bring you in as well in the shop's entrance this is rather important i guess so that they can do a little switcheroo there um and then we can also employ one more caretaker um and you're going to be also moving around freely and i think the other caretaker i have is going to be set into this first area anyway i think this is a good idea um so that's the one i just did do a little training on so this is the okay so you're going to go into shops entrance so you're going to roam around here i think that is nice uh, so money is coming in pretty nicely indeed um i don't know if actually did they already have the offspring so we can oh no they are fine they are fine again uh, what about the forest ones? Could they... Oh, yeah, they did. Oh, look at this. Look at this, guys. This is amazing. I'm, go I'm not going to take them from over here. This is easier to see. This is easier to see how good they are. So this is... Let's go for the 1.9. Is this one? The other one doesn't really matter. Um, so I'm going to go for... Let me just check if Samira has better stats over here. Yeah, Samira is great. So we're going to keep Ayush and Samira. And we're going to get rid of the... Actually... You know what? You know what? I'm also going... You know what? No, I'm going to go get rid of uh, Kelpit. And I hope that they both get animals next. And we're going to send you to the Trade Center. And then we should have already some animal... Uh, it's one. Uh, anyways, we can we can get some money from that. That's fine. So we have that this done. Really nicely done. Awesome. Now we can also investigate uh, other stuff. So high amount of litter is still over here in the front. Um, this should actually be going away if this dude is doing his job correctly. Can I already do the training? Set the training. I can already set it. Awesome. Just do your job first and then go training, okay? That is fine. So now, what else do we have over here? Zoo has no security guard, quarantine, and research center. I'm going to put them down now just so that this freaking annoying thing is stopping because I, I can't stand these things. I, I know, I said that in the past, but I really really hate these things these little bubbles telling me that i know i can click them away i know they did this but still nope it is really enjoying uh and <laughs> it's not <laughs> it's annoying okay and then we have like a research center i'm going to put this one just like here oh wait that, that's looking good let's put it here awesome so we've got this one we've got a workshop with oh we have a mechanic actually that is good so we can actually go into the mechanic research and we can make you use the aquatic theme look we nearly have researched everything oh and of course we need the new barrier but first of all let's do this i think that's the important bit over here and then we need a security guard yes let's do this security guard is coming in as well lovely okay so this is uh, quite a bit of uh, stuff going in and uh, that means we also need to pay attention a little bit more into let's make the prices a little bit higher here to make the prices of the units a bit higher i'm gonna go to every three months the same over here every three months i don't want them to be breaking down all the time you know look at that queue guys look at this shall we raise the prices again i mean it's i don't know let's let's say 11 50 27 53 blue umbrella 7 seven seven it's not raining so i don't care but still i got so many other umbrellas i don't know let's make the other ones more cheap that's fine we are still getting a lot of money which is great we are getting a lot more penguins which is also great um we don't have that many light sources over here are they really required i don't really know to be honest I really don't know. Also, I got a very nice blueprint from Dommel again. So again, if you guys want to take part in this build, make sure to send in some stuff because uh, that is very important. And you can see that I definitely have to get rid of all the Oak Street stuff. Uh, anyhow, so there should be the one from Dommel. And it was called the Rudy's Bar and Grill, which doesn't work because of the funds, but also because I haven't researched, right? It's 21,000. Oh my God. I wanted to put this down in today's episode. But I'm not really sure if we get the money. However, what is what is going on with the entrance prices? Are people happy? Let's have a look into the guest sort. Can we have these things? Let's go to zoo overview guest. So look at that. The zoo is pretty small. Yeah, okay. That, that's going to change over time. Uh, this is great. 
Time to go home. Thirst and toilet need. Okay, so I'm going to put down a toilet then. Uh, because it seems that they will need a toilet eventually. We're going to put down the toilet in this area over here. Just because I want them to go over there anyway. So that should be fine. And uh, there is a little space for you to go for a pee. How about that? Wait, why is this not... Is that because of the... Uh, hello? Um, let me just put this down here, okay? I think I can't because... Yeah, because of the water. Well, it doesn't matter. Wait, sorry. Okay, I'm hitting the... Uh, escape button a little bit too much. Wait, wait, wait what was... What, why, why is this not working? Obstructed, you say. This is valid. Um, that's interesting. Oh, because I need to raise the barriers first. Yeah, I can, I can do this quickly. But let me, first of all... Uh, that is interesting. Wait, what? I mean, I don't care too much, but... What is this even? That's pretty interesting. That is pretty interesting, guys. And you are definitely going to pay for that. You are going to pay for this, guys. No, 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 this is not, this is not... This is not uh, for free. What What do you even think? It's not. There you go. You just give your, your money to me. Facility broken down. You're kidding me. You're kidding me, right? Because I just... Oh, call the mechanic. Go. You know what I do? You know what I do? I'm gonna put down this freaking security camera just in here. Okay, so in case these people have the idea to do something, I'm gonna have the Yeah, that's the that's the smooth operator way of going down. I would also take that shortcut mate Yes, indeed. I would definitely just look at look at the Sun. Oh, look at this. Look at how the Sun is coming up Oh my god, I love this. I love this view. I love it all guys. It's really cool. Okay, while they are doing their stuff, we are still making money. I want to make more money. This means we need some more stuff. Oh, are we actually putting down an animal? Oh guys, I'm so... Let's have a look what kind of animals we have in our storage. <laughs> storage! Um, the tortoise would make sense, I guess. They make good money and we have got one Galapagos giant tortoise. Do we have also like a second one? I mean, they take, like, literally ages to grow up, which is a bit of a pity, but... I mean, we could easily get a second one, and this would be, like, a nice habitat we can have. You know what? We do two things at once. We make, like, a little habitat for the Galapagos tortoise here, and we're going to have, like, um, the exhibits as I was planning, actually. So, you, you know what? We are just going to do this. So, uh, let's go to facilities, put the small exhibit down, and this is going to be the terrapin that goes over here. 3,000, that's fine. And now we go to exhibit trading and we're going to look for the terrapin. Let's have a look. Scrolly, growly, moly. There are loads of animals. There's the terrapin. Diamondback terrapin. Yes. And yes. That's great. I mean, the problem will be that I haven't researched them. So this is the first thing I'm going to put our vet now on is this one. Oh, we haven't also done this. Ilk. Gonna have to do this next as well. I don't know if it makes sense to employ another vet, but I think for now it would not be the best idea. Um, okay, let's first of all put these things right where they belong. There's no layer thing I can do, right? Nope, not research yet. This is fine. This is actually fine. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay. Um, we also have to add this to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will add this to the first work zone. Let's quickly do the work zone setup. Staff work zones and exhibits entrance we're going to put this in it there you go that should be fine and then for the next habitat we actually need to employ someone else hey stop stop going there already i haven't had the bins yet to to you to throw your money on me and also where are the education things oh i haven't even put them down i'm such a bad person i am such a bad person guys okay so we're going to put this down here this down here and we're going to put this one down here Right, isn't that great? So, we're going to give you the giant forest education, and you get the giant um, desert one, and you get the diamondback terrapin, and we're also going to give you an educational speaker, which is going uh, just on... Well, oh gosh, okay, whatever. I'm going to rotate this so it doesn't look that bad. Uh, also, give me another color, please, just like 
gray, dark gray, whatever. Click, build, lovely, it's part of it. Wait, I can't even, you must be kidding, right? So can I have both things and that one not? Oh, wow, I need to, wow, just, wow. Okay, I first of all need to just drag that out. Diamondback Terrapin, yeah, that should be fine from the, from this perspective. There you go. They get a bit of education there. That should be fine. The reason why I put this a little bit further out, guys, is also to make sure that the people um, can travel already a bit into this area, and that should be fine. Just get some stuff here and there. You know, put a bench here and here. So what is broken down again? Facility broken down. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I even set this to... Okay, I'm gonna put this to one month. Has this been, has this been also destroyed? Because... This camera should actually be monitoring this. Look, do not do this, guys. I am looking at you. Looky, look. There's the mechanic coming. Is he is he bugging down again? No, he's actually running. That's wow. He's so sm he's so kind of quick. I mean, that's that's great. How many babies do we have actually? There's one baby standing over here. A second one over here. Two, two babies. Is that it? Two babies. Uh, it seems to be a road ride. Where's the rest? Are they diving down here? Oh, love it. Love it. How many animals do we actually have? Because I... How many animals? Um, three grown-ups and two babies. All right, now, never mind. I'm trying to get some more, if possible. Just because I think this uh, would make sense. There's another female. I mean, that's fine. That's fine. I'm gonna get some more of them. Uh, I hope that we will get better animals by the time, but more animals is also important. Um, yeah, the question is, do I employ another vet or not? Because the research seems to be running right now. Let's have a look how far she's in the research. Uh, 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 uh. Where's the bar? I missed the bar. Breeding research. Um, there's Oh, there's the bar. She's research level one. Is that the next thing which is, which is about to be done? Let's have a look. Boom. Done. That's great. Okay, cool. Now, this is done. Um, let me just quickly check on here if that makes sense. So, we have these two. Can I already put some layouts in? I cannot. Okay, so it's definitely time to... I'm. Am I employing another one? Or did I need to wait for this now? Let's have a look. Um, oh, I just needed to wait. Okay, fine. I'm just going to give you one, two. It doesn't matter. That's fine. Layout is fine. Everything is fine. Good. Good, good, good. I think to move forward, we are just going to get the torches as well, guys. Just to make sure that there is a bit of stuff going on. Uh, we are not getting the seal right now. We're going to look at this just later. Um, so let's de-check these animals. And then we are going to go... Why was the gorilla even? It doesn't matter. But uh, let's go to giant Galapagos tortoise. And if I remember correctly, we need a female one. Dang, boom, done. Was that correct? We've got golden one and now a female one as well. Right. Oh, great. I've got two females now. <sighs> yeah. 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 Fernando, Fernando, can you help me, Fernando? How much do I have? Yes, Fernando can help me. Fernando did help me. Awesome. Okay, Fernando is there. Great. Uh, yeah, we've done that. We will check the water in later. But first of all, let me just do the habitat now over here. Um, how? Wait, how about the mechanic research, by the way? Let me... Wait, wait. No, 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 no. Wait, let me just see where is he. Halfway through. Uh, okay, let's build the habitat and then it should be fine. Also, I think I can speed up the game during the build just to make some money, right? And speed up the research as well. While we do so... I'm going to, I think it would make sense to just continue the path over here uh, around the lake, but obviously the zoo should then also reach out into another area. So I'm going to make like a little plaza that goes in here and then the zoo stretches out. And this is just the beginning bay area, I guess. So I'm just going to make this like a little plaza area. That's nice, that's neat, that's awesome. What's going on here? Keeper cannot reach, uh, wait, oh wait, because, wait, why? But it is part of it, isn't it? I, you know what I'm going to do, obviously, is I'm going to put like a staff path in the backside now because that's, uh, yeah, 
Can we just make that a little bit less big? There you go. Also, I'm willing to have this like another pattern. It doesn't matter. It just, just looks better, okay? So just do it that way. So what are you even... Keeper cannot reach... But isn't that part of it? I mean, has no keeper aside. That makes no sense. Because... Oh, wait, did I... Uh, okay, maybe I just went into the work zone. Shops? I don't know. Uh, never mind, I just put the toilet in. Yeah, no, that was clever. That was, that was clever. Okay, vet research is great. Awesome, second one. You know what, I think this is fine now, and she can go on this one, so I'm, I'm not going to do this. Zoo, many things are underpriced. Well, that's great. Water treatment needs repair. Uh, I can't just click it now, but the... Yeah, I hope it's going to reset itself later. Uh, also, let me just get the money. Claim rewards. Education. Perfect. We are making money. Perfect. Everything is fine. Perfect. So, where's the mechanic, by the way? Can I... Oh, the mechanic is doing a research, right? Dang. There you go. Just stop doing this now. I think I have my blueprints of what I want now. And you can actually fix this now. Vip gas has arrived. Snibble. I can't open these things. Guys, I'll be back with you. I just need to restart quickly. There we go again, and now I should be able to click on things again. Let's see if the mechanic has fixed it. Yes, he has, and I can also click on things again. How cool is that? Right. Okay, so um, I wanted to say quickly hello to Ria and also hello to Snibble, just to get us these little awards of conservation credits. We're making decent money now, which is great. Um, I think I can also put the second layer. La, 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 la. I can't yet, but this hopefully works later. And people think ticket prices are underrated, so let's go to 7.5. Maybe that makes sense, I don't know. Um, guest happiness rating is pretty neat, so we are going to have a look into this even more than we already do. So this is just ridiculous over here. It's just freaking ridiculous, but I just cannot do anything else. However, I think I just got the aquatic pack. Is that correct by me? Let me just see if I did do the research. Yes, I did. And there's everything I need. Awesome. So now we can actually do some building, uh, which I prefer. But first of all, we're going to do the little Galapagos uh, tortoise habitat because that's going to be rather simple. Um, look at that. We do already have the glass gate. We're just missing out on the other gate. Uh, fence. That's fine, I guess. But okay. So we're going to do this. We're going to have like a very little habitat that stretches out in this area here. Just very easy. And this is going to be in the middle of some buildings, which is going to be cool. Actually, you know what? No, we, we are going to put this around this side here. It's going to stretch this out around the corner. There you go. It's like a little bit of a roundish area. So here he goes. And then this is going to be uh, covered in a house. So this will be part of the backstage area, so to say. Oops, no, I didn't want to do this. I wanted to do this and then uh, this. And then we go all the way over here to connect it. Awesome. I'm going to gra grab this, grab it and drag that out a little. Great stuff. And we're going to connect this gate here. Look at this. That is awesome. So we are having uh, done that. That's awesome. And now we can just take all of these and lower them down because the couple of, they, they will not escape. Okay, let's put it that way. They will not escape. Um, what we will do, we'll just bring the animals in real quick, uh, because I want to quickly just check what they... How do I have some? No. Go... <laughs> what was that? I was just confused, because, I, like, we don't have that many, do we? So, we have these two. I thought I can multi-select. Uh, excuse me? Game? I thought they added the multi-select. But it isn't. Is it broken again? Can I have the multi-select, please? I, I need this in my life. Give me my multi-select. I thought it was fixed. Is it not? Is it patched out? What is this? What is this sorcery? No. I want to have it. I want to have it. Okay. I think I'm going to now make a new work zone. Uh, simply because I have the feeling that this is a good idea. So let's just do that. And we call this Tortoise. There you go. And... I think we might, yeah, we might employ one more keeper because I think actually it makes sense. Let's put it that way. It might make sense. So you're going to work for the tortoise. There you go. And we name the habitat as well. Let's be a bit more nice this time. Okay, guys. So we are going to name actually the habitats. So this is tortoise. This is 
king penguin this is desert scorpion so i only always know what's happening over here this is the forest scorpion there you go okay so we have done all of that and um, we are making money which is also great what's that oh vet research is done lovely stuff so we've got the penguins uh, do we already have some enrichment items for them then let's have a look uh peng 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 there's the diving platform we had already the water jet enrichment is there also the feeder already down in here i think it's not right oh it is it also has some fish for them already rubber duck is also in here so we're only missing out on that little lovely little platform which is not researched yet all right okay i can i can deal with that we said hello to the people let me just claim that reward also pretty neat everything kind of neat everything kind of working that is really great over here um big fan of this i am a big fan of this um and now let's have a look what these animals need so enrichment zero percent i know welfare is already pretty okay habitat terrain let's check the terrain for them first so we can pretty much give it let me just pause the game real quick because also the people i don't want to lose the money on them uh long grass is too much sand is too less well actually you know what we are in a sandy area so let's just do it this way yes you get a bit of sand over here i'm gonna give them a bit of a molding i think that makes the whole thing a bit more interesting and then we are going to blend in the grass here until they are happy just making sure that this is not too much. There you go. Oh, they can also they also like a little bit of rock. So let's go a bit closer to the house. We have some rock. Noise. Okay, cool. Let's have a look. They want South Central America and the um, tropical stuff. So nature is going to go to, let's say, biome, continent, uh, South Central America. And it is tropical. No blueprints. And we're going to have some some little stuff down here. Not, you know, I'm not going to go too crazy because that's Newport Bay and we have to make sure that it's uh, only stuff that is feasible. I mean, we can have some palm trees over here. That makes sense, even though that's a big one. I'm just going to make this a bit lower um, to make it look good later on. It's, I just don't want to go too crazy. There's some, some good stuff in here. Uh, just having some of these things also put down in here. This tree is kind of neat. We can feature that one as well. And then I uh, wonder, you have enough space, right? Okay, you don't have hard shelter. This is going to be later. I like these ones. I know they need water and we're going to give them water. So let's just quickly go in here. Also, you know what? I want to keep the game on play again. So what I do, I'm just rather quickly putting all the necessary things in. And uh, actually, I hate the color of it. I want to have it a bit more marine marine blue let's do it that's not the color i wanted oh, like navy blue i should call it still not let's put it more into the darkish navy is that better yeah that's kind of it just gonna put them down for the moment we will arrange them in a nicer way okay so also the barrier looks obviously crap over here so we are going to make this uh, actually wood and then we make this one glass and over here this is going to be all wood as well there you go and i hope they are not stressing out too much but you know what they will hopefully look at this later on and then uh we're going to have doo -doo 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 -doo. let's just have a look that we can hopefully put the water in oh there's just a tiny tiny bit of water have you seen that let's just lo lower this down oh wait i can't because of the water let's just lower that all down a little bit and raise this side up as well let's just hope that obstructed why 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 is you obstructed i don't know why i don't know why do i have to put you here let's have a look if that is the problem or if the path is the problem let's have a look if that works yeah that was it so i just wanted to get this little bit of water in obviously they cannot traverse there but i think that's just fine Hard shelter and enrichment is missing. So let's give them, first of all, um, Galata. There you go. They, they get this one here. They get a food trough just here. 
they are going to get a heater, obviously, which is going to be put here. And the fruit spike gets there. Wait, wait, they also like the rubber duck? What? That is pretty interesting. Well, if so, you're gonna get a rubber duck from me because they are cool and cute. And I like them. So here you go. They like it, actually. I mean, how cool is that? Enrichment is a 90%. What's missing out? Species toy enrichment is missing out on. Okay, you get one more toy. You get the... You get the help sand. You know, why not? You have to travel there as well. Great stuff. Cool. You're gonna get your heart shelter in a second. Let me just put the bedding already down here somewhat. You know, there is some more offspring coming in. I love it. Okay, cool. So we've all done this, guys. Pretty neat. And um, now I'm gonna make like a little cut and I will put some uh, things in um, for the backside just to give you like a little idea of what it should be looking like in a second. Um, but I don't wanna, I don't wanna stress you too much with it. So I'll be back in a second with a bit of a little layout. All right, that shall be enough uh, preparation for the moment because I actually have already done uh, a few little things here just to, you know, get the groundwork. And then next episode, we're going to spend a bit more time on that. Um, so you can see um, the tortoise is actually doing pretty well. They only have not the hard shelter, which is going something, uh, this is something we are going to take a look in right now. So what we're going to do, you can already tell that I have uh, prepared a little bit of uh, stuff here. So what we're going to do, uh, we're going to take this lovely roof and we're going to put this uh, over here as a little shelter for them uh, just very plain simple we're going to get this in and then we're going to take uh, yeah like an easy color like that as a little uh, tile roof color that's pretty neat over here I don't know if that's enough for them already let's have a little look uh, oh wow that's not not even the slightest so what we're going to do then uh, we're going to just put this a little bit better into this corner if needed so we're going to get this in here copy one over and we can actually also put this into this corner like so um, what you also will see uh, right now already is that I needed to change a few things unfortunately uh, this is down to the fact that these animals seem to be a little more needy um, so uh, I kind of got them a little you know uh, oh wait do the zookeepers actually still be ah, this could be a problem let's just delete this thing then and this not sure if this is enough, but we're going to just get them another one here if this is possible. Yeah, I thought, okay, well, they might not get through there, but um, yeah, that's enough shelter, so that's fine. Good, okay, I was fearing this was a problem, but it's not great. Um, so I'm going to put this first building into perspective now, so you guys know exactly where this is going. So I want to do this building and the next one next to it, just to give you a glimpse of what I want to do. So this is basically the um, groundwork over here, and I'm just going to build this building over here as well, just to make sure you know what is happening. So I want to keep this fairly easy, uh, so meaning that I'm also going to make sure this all looks pretty much nice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep, you know what? I'm gonna keep this wall lower, and we're going to do this with this building. Makes the things a bit easier for me. Uh, I'm not going to make it that high as the other one. Uh, let me just quickly check if this is. Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. It can, it can go in there like this. That's fine. I'm gonna keep this as a balcony over here. That's nice. So we're going to push this all the way down here. Is it actually snowing right now? Are you even kidding me? Are you even kidding me? Night and snowy. I mean, I mean, that's kind of crazy because we are in August. But hey, I mean, sure, this is Europe. Why not? Oh my God. I, um, yeah, no, it would be great to, to change that at some point. You know what's also funny? I put already a heater in. Um, so I'm going to put like another one to this tree. That should be fine. So they, they are doing good then. Um, vet research is complete. We can just click OK here. The penguin shouldn't be too worried about these temperatures anyway, so <laughs> that's not too big of a deal. Um, and I'm just going to finish this real quick over here. So in this case, I want to just have one more layer. Actually, give me this one is a little bit thinner. So I'm just going to do this and just have this little bit sticking out a tiny bit here in the front. Just want to have a little bit of a nice little second layer. It's not even a balcony, but just a second layer thing. And what I'm going to do then is I'm just going to have like a little bit of a backdrop wall here. Oh wait, I took the wrong color, right? Yeah, that's a problem at night. You just tend to have the wrong color in. So let me just see if they even see that from below. Yeah, that's enough. We're gonna push the rest back a little, but that should do the trick. So here we go. 
Just going to push that all in. And then we're going to put them a little bit to the back side. There you go. You know what? Actually, I should do this with the uh, grid pieces because that makes my life a little bit easier for uh, the building of the roof. So I'm going to use the grid pieces, actually. Let me just pick up. I don't know if that's the same color. It's a little bit hard to distinguish right now here with the, uh, with the snow. But I think we should be fine. So I'm going to push this back like this. And then we have that one as a lower ground here. Perfection. Great. So this is how I want to have it. Um, or actually, you know what? Let me just see from there. I don't want to make it too tall, you know? No, I'm going to keep it this way. That's fine. And then we're going to just uh, drop this to the back side here. It doesn't really matter too much. And now let's go for roof. And we're going to take the tile roof again because that's just great stuff. And then this is obviously the small one where we have to use this here. Uh, so I'm going to use that one exactly. But I'm going to make the roof... I don't know, like so. We have to we have to see it in daylight. It, I yeah. Um, we just wait until it all works. I also, also don't know why the opening hours are so crazy in this zoo. I might change it because at the moment it's just ridiculous. Uh, yeah, and we're going to keep this route. Wait, uh, maybe we can just rotate that a little bit different. I'm not even sure if I. No, you know what? I'm going to do something else. I'm going to have this roof. Does this even make sense? Not really. It's not really making too much sense what I'm doing over here. That is it. Yes, but it's not the same height. Why is it not the same height? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna lower this. Now I'm gonna keep it that way and do it just like so. And then we have this little double stack in the front. That should be fine as long as it works this way. It's all good. So gonna keep it here. Wait. There you go. That's it. And uh, one thing that is really important, guys, this is also going to be just scenery. So I'm not going to fill that all in. I'm just going to put like a blank wall to the back and that's fine. So this is really only scenery and we are going to keep it that way. This will be the staff area anyway. So I'm going to keep that fairly open and push some more staff buildings in here. Um, so that makes the whole thing hopefully a bit more easy. And over here, we are just going to have like one raised area and then we're going to keep it fairly simple like this and can it also just stop snowing now oh my god it's like you i i really hate that this episode ended up being like this for you guys but it's like what time is it even 7 15 in the morning oh my goodness okay so this is noise we have that one it's all covered over here to the side we need to make it from two sides available so i'm going to make it make it like this so cover this fully and then I'm going to put something else as the next building to it, but it's okay. We're going to have it this way. Good. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, cool. Let's just put this roof now in here, just as a little bit of a change of pace. And I want to have this like in a bit of a brighter color. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm going to put also this one down here, like so. And we have it also for the back. Great, and then we're just going to have a very easy roof thing like... So I want to have it stick out one over here and one over there, one over there. And if I'm not wrong, I should be able to... Yeah, exactly, do it this way. Nice, that looks pretty neat. Looks really neat to me. I just want to have these six roofs and make them also white. Like, at least in different white grayish tints, if if that's fine by you and then we can make that one and no why, why not make it like the same bluish tint a little green bluish whatever so that's fine so this is how that looks let's exit this look i mean this is already getting the whole thing a bit of a nicer vibe now i want to still lower down this one even though they seem to be a bit stressed i don't want to keep it uh, too much but oh my god why just lower that down yes oh, wow. well that worked pretty well didn't it there you go <laughs> just making sure that they still have this in place great that's kind of cool that is kind of cool let's just have a little look is it still the same yes we can still have the same i uh, just want to make sure that we do have a little tree or something in here just to make the looks of this corner a bit nicer so maybe have this mangrove no, that doesn't make too much sense what about what about something like that this is this is way better this is way better i appreciate this 
the only thing I do not appreciate is that one over here. Um, I think it would be nicer to just cover this up with this building and in, in, in full, fully with this building, you know? Just getting in like so. And then I'm going to... I'm going to spice this up by just putting in... Let me just quickly check. I need a different wall. I'm going to use this wall. There you go. And then this wall over here as well. Like so. Let me see if I can at least do something like this. Yeah, that is a bit better. This looks a bit better, guys. And then I'm just going to push this out. Yeah, no. There you go. I wonder if I can just quickly get rid of this little ugly overlap there. I'm just going to push it all the way up a little. Yay, there you go. Looks nice. Looks nice. This is this is exactly going to be the, the, the way I want to go. Um, and I'm just going to put some windows on. And then we're already pretty much done for this area. And this is then just for today's episode 8 um, what we want to do. So quickly. No, get rid of it. There you go. Some windows. And we're going to use... I'm going to use some normal windows, okay? So I'm going to have like three-ish here. They also fit very nicely into this uh, scheme. I want to use the smallest windows available. I think they are fairly small. So I'm going to use these small. And I need some bigger ones here just to have this false perspective uh, going on. This is very important to make sure this looks taller than it actually is. Which it does, which I appreciate. And then we can have these windows. Like here. Like this. And I wonder if we can put something big over here. Yes, we can. That's kind of nice. And just like a small-ish thing for the middle over here. Yes, we can put that in. It looks fairly okay. It looks fairly okay. Oh, one thing that doesn't look okay, by the way. We need... No. We need to have a back wall. There you go. This is nice. In fact, this is actually, you know... We would need to have something where the keeper could actually reach this habitat, but it's okay. I mean, for the moment, that's totally fine. I can I can definitely deal with it the way it is. Um, and it, it's looking rather cool, you know? It's looking rather fine um, from many different places. I mean, oh, there's already, like, a baby tortoise. Look at this. Uh, shall we just quickly, <laughs> quickly close this off over here? Because otherwise, from this perspective, it looks rather rather weird. So I'm going to, is the, the weather is changing again to snow, isn't it? No, it's rain. Okay, well, I can deal with rain. Rain is fine, but like no snow again, please. Okay, so that is that is pretty nice. Look at look at this. This looks this looks decent enough to me. That looks decent. Oh my god, this is such a small one, such a small tortoise. Uh, but only two, which is great. I I hate when there's having so many things. Yeah, rain is rain is kind of nice as well. It's not, but it's okay. So yeah, this is how it looks, and and we will do some more detailing on these buildings. They look rather. Well, actually, the, the roof looks rather dull now. I'm sorry, the... Uh, yeah. Because of the rain, it just... Uh, and the snow, it just didn't look the way I wanted it. Let's keep it white, okay? Yeah, that's better. That's better. And we will have some more nice-looking buildings in the front here. So that this whole area is looking like a little bay area. We will have, like, a bit of a tower as well. But I think for the moment... This is where I wanted to go with you. We made some decent money today. Some decent money. We've got some vet research done. We've done some workshop research. There are loads of cool things done. Um, and I really hope you guys appreciate it. Look at how much you can distinguish the blue now. Real cool stuff. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Some little fishy. I like fish as well, by the way. I am hungry now. Okay, cool guys. This is it for today. Um, bit of a longer episode, but I hope you appreciate. This has been uh, the work we've done today. So we integrated the terrapin. We integrated the, uh, the Galapagos tortoise. And yeah, just in general, I really hope you appreciated today's episode of taking things a bit more slow. Just as you commented, but again, just a little reinforcement. I do love to do this over here. I love the franchise. And then a little reminder, if you want to be part of it, just send in your blueprints, just as Dommel did. Um, over here with the uh, restaurant that you can see. I could put down now. I, at least I'm going to show this to you. I'm not going to put it down right now, but I mean, just look at the building. It fits rather nicely in here, so I'm 
really looking forward to putting that in. I don't know where exactly, but it, it fits the style, which is already pretty decent. So in case you want to bring in something again, you know, Newport Bay Club from Disneyland is the kind of inspiration. So if you want to build something according to this, I'm going to build this into this series. And now if you guys want to help me read the 50K, we are really close, guys. We are getting super close. In case you haven't subscribed yet and you want to help, please do so. That would help me out a lot and I would really appreciate. But most importantly right now, Stay safe, everyone. Have a great time. And we talk to each other in the next one. So have a good time and goodbye.